Talk Hi Linda. guys, you're welcome back to my video. It's weekend and I bring to you guys another amazing opportunity. In this video, I'll be talking about these care homes in UK that are recruiting with visa sponsorship. Guys, they are still recruiting and they offer visa sponsorship. So guys, if you are a support worker, if you are a nursing assistant, what are you waiting for? If you are a mental health nurse, this opportunity is just for you. What you have to do is just to get your CV ready, tailor your CV according to the job description and apply. So guys, what are we waiting for? Without wasting so much time, let's go to my screen so that I can show you what I have for you guys today. Don't forget to apply aggressively. Let's go. So guys, the first opportunity I will be talking about today is the opportunity of a support worker as you can see on my screen this job was posted on the 15th of august 2023 what you have to do is just to scroll down a little bit and remember you will be working with the Lancashire county council in uk so guys what you have to do is just to scroll down a little bit and you will see something about the job description it reads salary 21.1892 21.968 per year that is in pounds and the job is either part-time or full-time and 35 hours per week so guys it is very important to work full-time when you are looking for a sponsorship job and as you can see it states international sponsorship this role is open to international sponsorship and i'll read further you will, you will support people in a day service settings who need additional help to live independently. So guys, you will be working as a support worker. And if you scroll down a little bit, you see something like, we are looking for people who will bring compassion, empathy, and a sense of purpose into the lives of others. You will enable people to learn new skills, provide assistance to someone who has a disability or needs support with aspect of their care. So remember, you will be working as a support worker with people who have disability. You could support someone out and about in the community. You will, you will complete administrative tasks connected to the role. You will have plenty of opportunity to progress with training and gaining qualifications while you work. Benefits of working in adult services. Working in adult social care is not just an emotionally rewarding role. It's one of the most varied too. So guys, what you have to do is just to read everything about this job. You know, I cannot read everything. But because you are the person applying, make sure you read everything so that you know what you are going into. You already know they need a support worker and you will be working with disabled people. So that is the base. So what you have to do is to continue reading and you know they offer visa sponsorship and the state we reserve the right to close down a vacancy early before the closing date if we receive sufficient application so guys what you have to do is just to hurry and apply because they might close the application earlier if they have sufficient application so guys it is always advisable to apply as soon as possible and if you want to know more about the description of this job you just need to come here job description and person specification then you know what they need what they need the kind of person they need what this the kind of skills they need so guys if you want to know about all that you click here on the job description and person specification after that you just click to apply for job when you click to apply for job it takes you to to apply for this job please visit this website it's too long so i cannot read it all and when you click to the website it takes you now to a page where you will get a proper view or a proper description of the job and everything. And as you can see, job description, and it is well stated that this role is open to international sponsorship. So guys, what are you waiting for? And if you want to apply for this job, you just click on this apply button. But before you click on that apply button, I want to show you guys something. If you keep scrolling down, you see something like similar jobs. And guys, you can just try to read over them and apply. And you see something like see more jobs. When you click on see more jobs, more will appear. What you have to do is just to read about them and see if you can apply. This is an opportunity for you to search this website very well so that you can apply for more than one or two of these jobs. Guys, 
it is very very important and when you go back to the bottom of the page you see something like apply now and when you click on the apply now button it states you don't need to have an account get started right away by simply using your email your profile will be created and kept up to date automatically as you enter details for each of your job applications so guys what you have to do is just to pull in, put in your email address i'll put in my email address and you agree to the terms and then you click next when you do that it will take you to verification they will send you a verification code to your email where you have to fill it in and then you proceed so guys that is that for the job the next job opportunity i want you all to see is the position of a support worker or a youth support worker and they offer overseas sponsorship guys this job was just posted one hour ago and you will be working with living water services limited limited some people will say yeah they don't want to work with uh let's say agencies but guys it is always good to try always try as you can see living water services limited is a social care provider based in uk currently recruiting support workers to come and work in uk and on a skilled worker visa international candidates only this recruitment or this agency is only uh, recruiting international candidates guys and then they are in need of a support or they are in need of support workers guys they don't just need one but they need many as many as possible the role is to provide care and support to care and support in a supported living environment for vulnerable children and young people with experience of safeguarding children and young people with low medium and high risks of and high risks risk assessment initial and ongoing assessment formulating support or care plans working with children and young people with challenging behavior so guys you already know what you are going to do what you have to do next is just to make sure you read everything and the state full training induction and support are provided before commencing work the id candidate needs to be a, a empathic caring and compassionate guys when you are going to work as a caregiver or support worker remember you have to be you have to be empathetic that's the, that's what it takes to work as a caregiver you have to be emotional so that's what they want you to know so guys what are you waiting for you just have to scroll down read everything about this job and apply and it states lws will provide successful candidate with a sponsorship certificate to apply for a skilled worker visa which will entitle them to a minimum of a three-year work permit in the uk so guys they are going to offer you a sponsorship uh certificate for you to be able to live in uk for three good years so guys i think this is an opportunity for you and guys they offer training they do not need a lot of experience procedures screening application form interview the successful candidate will need to submit to lws that's their name scan copies of the foreign application document this must be in color and certified remember you have to certify your documents before sending in to them and it has to be in color do not forget a valid passport the inside and the cover a valid police clearance certificate a valid tuberculosis certificate certificate of qualification at a level or equivalent if a degree holder degree certificate and transcript a current a current driving license proof of proficiency in english in the form of english l s e l b1 guys make sure you read everything so guys if you know you want to apply for this position guys i think it is something very good it is very good for anybody if you want to apply because their requirements are not so difficult just read everything and apply guys read through when you go down you see something like required document english proficiency and they say to prove english proficiency the candidate will be required to undertake one of the following options guys this is what you have to know about the english proficiency so guys remember to have your tuberculosis test is a must keep going down keep going down and when you are done you see something like apply for this job what you have to do is just to up, click on the apply button and it takes you to to apply for this job please visit www.glassdoor.com click on glassdoor.com and then you continue with your application process the last but not the least job opportunity i want to show you is a position of a mental health nurse and the offer overseas sponsorship as you can see this job was posted one day ago 
and you will be working with Kent and Medley NHS and Social Care Partnership Trust. You know what it means when you are working with the NHS Trust? It is very juicy. And they say, are you a qualified mental health nurse looking to move and work in UK? Have you passed your eyes and CBT with decision letter from NMC to grant permission to undertake OSCE? Guys, this is also another opportunity. What you have to do is just to scroll down and read everything about this job opportunity. As you can see, they have a lot of bonuses. They say new higher bonus, £1,200. Eyes. Guys, accommodation for two months plus rent deposit, flight ticket. They pay for your accommodation for two months. They, play, they pay for your visa fee. They pay for your flight to UK. So what are you waiting for? What you need is just to read everything and apply. This is something I know most of you will be interested. If you are a nurse in your home country, why not use this opportunity and migrate to UK? Before you know it, you'll be in UK. So guys, Continue to scroll down until you get to the bottom of the page. Make sure you read everything and understand it very well. If you don't understand, try to read it very well. And when you get to the bottom of the page, you realize that the closing date is the 31st of August. And if you want to apply for this job, just click on apps.trackjobs. When you click there, it takes you to the next page where you have to fill in everything. And you see, they say qualified mental health nurses, overseas applicant. And then you start filling in your application, guys. Remember to create an account. And that, everything is done. So, guys, I wish you guys good luck. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. See you on my next video. Bye.